Holy Cross at Prayer for April 19th, 2021. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. As they were talking about these things, Jesus himself stood among them and said to them, Peace to you. And continuing Acts 3. And now, brothers, I know that you acted in ignorance, as did also your rulers. But what God foretold by the mouth of all the prophets, that his Christ should suffer, he thus fulfilled. Repent, therefore, and turn back, that your sins may be blotted out, that times of refreshing may come from the presence of the Lord, and that he may send the Christ appointed for you, Jesus, whom heaven must receive until the time for restoring all the things about which God spoke by the mouth of his holy prophets long ago. Countless times Jesus told his disciples that suffering comes before glory. The prophet Isaiah foretold of this reality. He was wounded for our transgressions. He was crushed for our iniquities. Upon him was the chastisement that brought us peace, and with his stripes we are healed. Christ the King came as a servant to suffer and die in our place so that we might be restored, forgiven, released. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, bless Chuck with faith in you and fervent love toward all those who cross his path this day. Through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. O God, through the humiliation of your Son, you raised up the fallen world. Grant to your faithful people, rescued from the perils of everlasting death, perpetual gladness and eternal joys. Through Jesus Christ, our Lord, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, and the love of God, and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with you all. Amen.